Hey everybody, Boxing Boat back in. First, let me apologize to anybody's videos that I missed. I'm catching up at, on them after a busy weekend. I've been playing a ton of baseball with my son, getting getting him ready, um, doing stuff like that, Memorial Day weekend and everything. I, I have been catching up and I've been commenting, but if I haven't got to your video, don't think I'm not going to because I'm getting to it today. Um, I'm slowly getting caught up. So bear with me and I will get to your video. So I apologize to anybody's video. If you think I missed you, I haven't. Um, I want to talk about bedding. Okay, a while back ago, by the way, this is Phoenix. I got this beautiful girl from David Moore. Um, I've been using newspaper for probably about the last year and a half, two years. I've used Aspen. I've used Cypress Mulch, and, and the big thing with Aspen litter is because a lot of people buy it from pet stores, and, and even some Cypress Mulch and other beddings they buy from pet stores. Um, what happens is, not that the mulch necessarily has mites, but the pet stores do have mites on their snakes. Almost every pet store does. Um, so I kind of went away from that because I was worried about mites and stuff like that, but um, thanks to Stephen Katz, um, and I'll leave a description of that video on his frontline treatment um, for mites. I use this now for mites. This thing, literally, it's frontline spray. It's the 500 milliliter. This thing will last me years. It's I've treated all. Well, I'm not gonna tell you how many snakes. Let's say I got over 50 snakes on <laughs> um, my snakes before. Not all of them had one snake with mites, but I went ahead and treated everybody because if one has, you gotta treat them all. Steven talked me through it. Um, so now I'm gonna, the one thing about newspaper, and I'm gonna go back to that, is this is what happens with newspaper. I'm gonna bring her up close. As you can see, the ink stain. Okay, now this is a beautiful snake, and I'm, I'm not happy about what newspaper does. It doesn't do it all the time, but what happened is, she was in her cage and she decided that she wanted to flip her water bowl, which as many of you snake keepers know, they like to do. Um, and even though I got to it right away, she did happen to get the newspaper wet and then moved her head and I did clean it. I mean, it could have been more than probably 15 minutes before I got to it. That's how often I, I check on my snake and my son checks on the snakes. Um, and it's saying her head. Now there is butcher paper and things like that, um, but I'm going to go back to probably Cypress Bed. I really like Cypress bedding. I've used it in the past. It, 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 it does wonderful and it just looks better and I just, I, I'm, preferring, I'm preferring to go back to that. Um, I'm not saying that you have to do that. I'm not sitting there saying that it's the only bedding, but I like it. I like the way it looks. It's, it, and, and the nice thing about Cypress bedding is because them type of trees um, are water type trees, they can grow in standing water. They, they live in, you know, like the Everglades, they come from the Everglades and other moist places like that. The mold reduction on those, they have great mold resistance. So I'm definitely going to be switching back to that today. I'm actually going to be going to Home Depot and, and or Lowe's or one of the places. Again, you just got to make sure you get one that doesn't hasn't been treated or anything like that. I'll be going that, back to that. Now if I do end up with any mites, not to fear. I got this. Now this is alcohol based. Literally all I do is I put a rubber glove on, two rubber gloves on, I spray it, you know, two or three times and then I just sit there and I take it and I go like this over the snake and let the snake naturally go through my hands. And I do that and literally one treatment and it doesn't take much because alcohol based it dries really quick and you know when it dries it will go like that and the alcohol smell will go away. Um, takes care of any mites you have. So if you have any mite issues or you're battling mites, don't battle mites no more. Get this stuff. You can get it on Amazon. I think I paid like 50 bucks for this. Get it from there. So, you know, um, definitely. I, I do know a lot of people that use butcher paper and it is good. But for me, I'm just going to go back to it. And, and realistically, with all my cages and stuff, you know, I buy, I don't know, probably 10 bags. That's going to last me probably six months. Um... And, and really, you buy 10 bags, you're talking 25 bucks at the most. Especially if you can find it on sale. So definitely worth the money. And, and just for aesthetics, I'm switching back to that. So anyway, I wanted to share that. Now another snake, I'm going to actually hear Priest. Let me hold the camera real quick. Sorry guys, he's going to hand me a snake. He's got one around him right now. 
And so I'm going to talk to you up close. How you doing? No, I'm just messing with you guys. Here we go. Now this snake you guys see a lot. And this is Prada. And look at them blue eyes. I mean, just stunning. This is probably my favorite boa that I own. I ain't going to lie. This is my favorite boa. I love all my snakes. All my snakes are my favorite. But this is one that I could, this would be the last snake, if I had to get rid of any boa, this would be the last boa I would get rid of. She's a super stripe, and look at that. Look, look at that. Look at the color. I mean, this girl is just orange, red, pink. I mean, her head is just so deep, rich in color. It's just absolutely gorgeous. I mean, just a stunning, stunning snake. I, I just definitely probably my favorite boa I own and I have big plans for her down the road definitely gonna be taking my time with her growing her up as you see and just and even underneath you can see just how she's got that orange pink belly big time I mean just absolutely gorgeous I truly got lucky and blessed when I got this girl from mainly boas and I know I show off a lot but you can see why I do it um, anyway not on another note Good news, guys. I hit my ultimate goal, like I told you on a video of 2 i I've actually went below that now, and I've hit 206 and 207. So, definitely feel much better. My the, the stress on my back is way better than what it was been. As you guys know, I got hit by that front end loader, so I'm definitely, you know, I mean, I messed up from it. But I'm definitely getting it back under control with my weight and things like that, which will help my, my lower back. Um, so I'm so thankful for that and thanks for all the people that congratulated me and 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 helped support me on that I, I appreciate that so much so look at her in this look at that oh in the Sun just absolutely gorgeous absolutely love it now don't get me wrong I'm not gonna sit there and say this is a pastel um, more than likely yes yeah, she's a pastel super stripe but I have to prove that out in breeding, and so that'll that's going to be a fun project to go with her. And uh, I, I'm not sure who I'm going to put to her yet. I'm um, definitely leaning probably towards my Sterling, my Hypo 100% hit Sterling, and seeing what those two do with each other. I think that'll be an interesting with her Super Stripe, and then the the Sterling 100. Uh, a Sterling is just basically patternless. So with her color, his color, I, I just I think the hits from that will be spectacular. But we'll see. But anyway, so I'm definitely switching back to Cypress Mulch. Like I said, use Frontline if you get mites. It's not an issue. And that way you don't have this. Unless you want to go buy like butcher paper or something like that, which is always a good alternative. So just a little thought today. And like I said, I will get back to everybody's videos. I do apologize. I am getting to them. So I just thought I'd show these two snakes off and explain to you about what I'm doing here. And yeah. So anyway, this is Boxing Ball. Please like, click, share, and subscribe. And as always, if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. You know I will get back to you. Thank you guys so much for watching my videos. Anyway, you guys have a good day. This is Boxing Bowl. Peace.